Greetings and welcome, fellow doctors, to another episode of Let's Play Two Point Hospital. Alright, we are here in beautiful Duckworth upon Bilge, and we are trying to not tear out our hair in frustration. Stop giving me training assignments. Please. I am only a simple chief of medicine, please. I need some researchers. And I'll say this in the calmest voice that I can muster at this stage in time. Trying to enunciate as loudly as I can and sure. Come on in. Alright, come on, give me something a little bit more useful if I have to employ someone. I'm probably gonna need more seating than this. Let's get the leaflet stand out of the way. Damn it. Right. Abominable curse, a contagious disease, has been detected in the hospital. The two point center for disease control, the TBCDC, will reward us if they don't have to get involved. We have been issued a limited supply of vaccines. It's up to us to vaccinate people displaying a telltale signs of the disease before it spreads. If we run out of vaccines or too many infected people escape, the TPCDC will step in and handle the epidemic. Abominable, abominable curse is characterized by a peculiar walk, reminiscent of the patient suffering from premature mummification, which we haven't seen yet and will not see for some time. The disease spreads through a powerful and ancient sneeze. Alright, so there's currently four infected people. We have 20 vaccines. The more vaccines we actually have uh, by, the end, by the time we uh, vaccinate all the, the infected people, we get a bonus for. So that's uh, good. I'll take you now. Generate money. Alright, so now I'm looking for people that have their arms splayed out before them as if they are pretending to be a mummy. Like this one. And we'll just simply apply the vaccine. Now, uh, aside from the walk, you also kind of have to walk, uh, look out for people, because it says yeah, it's been spread by an ancient and powerful curse. This is actually quite liter literal. It's when you see someone sneezing so hard they actually almost collapse. That's likely someone uh, infecting everyone around them. Now, obviously, I can only tell if someone is infected if they walk. And everyone can be infected, including the staff. So, right, I think you are infected. And if it's someone on the staff, that's pretty particularly difficult to detect because, well, they usually don't leave the rooms. Although in this case, I can see it's you. Over. And that's another bit of good stuff. Training course completed. All right. So currently we're making fine money. Hungry, uh, fine. Right, I need to upgrade another machine. I'll upgrade the heart racer. Alright, so I think I saw us a new disease coming in.
Where is it? Ah, oh, there it is. Right, this is the telltale sign of someone with 8 bitten. I can't currently cure this disease, even though, even though it's one of our uh, objectives. Because I kind of do want to do the research to just get the 8 bitten machine. But, or the uh, resolution lab, I believe it's called. But first, I want to be assured that I have actually what I need. Motivated has potential, absolutely. You're on the staff. Alright, what staff do I have currently? Let's see, two healers. And a lot of people that are not assigned to anything in particular. Um... Yeah. Well, I need more people uh, to be able to uh, do the stuff, so... Let's get some more nurses actually trained up. Because I need my diagnosis machine working as efficiently as possible with a limited amount of effort. Buy 115 cans of tuna and get one free. And if you sign up for our store card, you'll get our exclusive one-time use Crumley can opener. So come on down to Crumley Mega Market in Duckworth upon Bills. Now, as near as I can tell, none of the uh, requests that you get have actually anything to do with what uh, you're capable of. Like, it, for instance, it will uh, give you assignments to generate research points, even if you don't have a research office, which is why, partly why I built one early. Now, you can refuse these, of course, just by clicking this, but there's a penalty involved. Currently, we need to get our reputation up above 60. As long as we keep going as we are, that shouldn't be a problem, but, you know... It's not gonna make it easy on us. Alright, what kind of janitors do I have? None of them that can be trained, so... Yeah, you come along. Now, I would really like... Training course completed. The weak bladder is fine. Right, train a janitor. Let's get another ghost capture. Let's not get another ghost capture. Alright, if I can maintain this amount of cash ish, I'll probably try to research the 8 bit and machine at the very least, the resolution lab. But, uh, see if we can get there. Why are you so unhappy? Unhappy about pay. Doctor to I probably need another sack. Send home. Mm, that's fine. I can recover from this. After all, this guy is only a level one researcher with a lot of useless skills. I can replace him.
Mm. Yeah, let's head home because I can't do it. No. My latest attempt at finding a hobby, bird watching. Man, those things are fast. Also, people get nervous when you carry binoculars wherever you go, especially when you're staying in your back gardens. Training course complete. Class dismissed. Now, right, come on. Give me a good assignment, please. Upgrade a machine, all right. Upgrade machines at the very least is something easy to do. I mean, I could do that, but I kind of want to wait until I get an option to do it. Turtle heads. Turtle head patients on the way. I can handle turtle head. We've got the the, the means to build that room. And uh, let's see, that's a four by four minimum. Lots of ten plants. All right, that's something that's a very, at the very least, easy to do. I mean, the reward I don't think is quite as high for watering plants, but at least that's something I can do. Or at least something that can be done almost without thinking. 
Alright, so we got some money. Let's actually get our uh, thing going. Alright, and we're already running a little bit of a problem in that I don't quite have enough uh, GP's offices. Nor doctors really to staff them. I can build that. Yeah, it's in it in injection room. Can I build that? Not here. Space is a premium, but you know, screw it. And actually, as we have epidemics here, I should probably be putting uh, hand sanitizers in places. As I kind of don't want the epidemics. They might be useful in a pinch to make some money, but overall, they're more problems than, have trouble than they're worth. By a long shot. Actually, let's move you over to here as well. Give me a good doctor. Good doctor. Bad doctor. Now, this, this assignment is actually something I can force because I've got plants pretty much in every room. And I can just tell my uh, people to water them. To speed things up. Even if they don't really need water just yet. Drink. Drink you. Feckless green ornament. More plants! Give me more plants! Send patient home. 
then that'll do for this episode. Thank you all for watching. See you all next time.